So on this video, I'm going to show you how you can uh, add or subtract days to a date field. Um, if I'm going to be using this form, birthday calculation as a birth date field, um, I'm going to add a new date field here. We're going to call it um, expiry date. And then I have several options uh, to add the calculation, but in this case, I'm going to use the birth date field, configured field actions. And basically what we want to do is only set a variable. In this case, we're going to set the expiry date with the input field birth date. And we're going to add the date function days. And we're, you can change the number of days that you want to move this into the future so it can be 15 or it can be 32 or it can be 60 days for example so we save this and then if we test it we can see that if i select today 60 days in the future would be up december 8, 2015. and you can utilize uh, pretty much all the functions that are, are already pre-configured in uh, Zoho to uh, calculate new days. I mean, a day, or you can do business days, or you can add months, or weeks, or years, or you can even subtract days, months, weeks, or years. So if I want to subtract a year, two years to the day, to the birth date, you know, the expiry date input fields birth date and then the function sub year and you change the number of years that you want to modify and then we test it so if i select today two years in the past is october 9 2013 so there you have it this is how you can add or subtract days to a date field in zoho creator